September 17, 2023, a $100 million F-35 stealth fighter ejected its pilot over South Carolina and kept flying. For 11 minutes, it soared through the skies with no one at the controls. The military couldn't find it. Radar couldn't track it. It vanished. And when they finally located the wreckage 70 miles away, the world realized something terrifying. The F-35 didn't need a pilot to fly. Now that accident has become a weapon, and China and Russia are watching in fear. That incident wasn't a malfunction. It was a glimpse into the future. The F-35 stayed airborne because of advanced autopilot systems designed to stabilize the aircraft. But here's what changed everything. Lockheed Martin saw what happened and said, what if we made that intentional? Fast forward to 2025, and the F-35 is now being upgraded to fly without a pilot on purpose. Not just fly, but command entire fleets of drones, control weapons, make decisions, and strike targets deep inside enemy territory. All while the pilot sits safely hundreds of miles away. Or maybe there's no pilot at all. This isn't science fiction. It's happening right now and it's rewriting the rules of warfare. For the United States military, this is a game changer. For China and Russia, it's a nightmare they never saw coming. If you find this as incredible as we do, type yes in the comments below. Let's go back to that September day. Colonel Charles Del Piezo was flying his F-35B through heavy rain near Charleston. Suddenly, the jet systems began to fail. Radios went silent. Navigation flickered. His helmet display, a $400,000 piece of technology, cut out three times. In the chaos, he made a split-second decision. Eject. He landed in someone's backyard, knocked on the door, called 911, and reported his fighter jet missing. But here's the thing. The jet wasn't done flying. It climbed. It banked. It stayed airborne for over 11 minutes, flew 64 nautical miles, no pilot, no commands, just pure autonomous control. The military launched a massive search. They asked the public for help. Have you seen an F-35? It became a national headline, and for good reason. The jet was so stealthy, even US radar couldn't detect it. Think about that. America's own military lost track of one of its most advanced machines because it was designed to be invisible. That's how good this aircraft is. The transponder failed. The stealth coating worked too well. For 30 hours, it remained hidden. Now, some called it pilot error. Others called it a systems failure. But military planners saw something else. They saw proof. Proof that the F-35 could fly, navigate, and survive on its own. And if it could do that by accident, Imagine what it could do on purpose. By May 2025, Lockheed Martin made it official. The F-35 would become pilot optional. Not a drone in the traditional sense, but a fighter jet that could operate with or without a human inside. The CEO called it a fifth generation plus upgrade. Translation, sixth generation technology packed into the world's most combat proven stealth fighter. And it's not just about flying solo. The real power is what happens when you combine that autonomy with artificial intelligence. In January 2025, Lockheed Martin demonstrated something groundbreaking. An F-35 controlling a drone mid-flight, using AI, through a touchscreen tablet in the cockpit. The pilot gave commands, the drone obeyed. It scouted ahead, drew enemy fire, launched weapons, all while the F-35 stayed hidden. Now scale that up. One F-35 can control up to five drones at once. Each drone carries missiles, sensors, electronic warfare tools. That's not one fighter anymore. That's a squadron commanded by a single pilot or no pilot at all. The cost? A fraction of traditional fighters. The impact? Absolutely devastating. Before we go further, if you're enjoying this, take a second to like this video and subscribe. Over 98% of viewers watch without subscribing. It costs nothing, but helps us bring you more content like this. So why does this terrify America's adversaries? 
start with China. They've spent billions developing the J-20 stealth fighter. On paper, it looks impressive. But there's a problem. Chinese pilots don't train like American pilots. They're micromanaged from the ground. Every maneuver, every decision, controlled by commanders in a tower. American pilots? They're trained to be battlefield managers. They adapt. They improvise. They make split-second calls at 40,000 feet. China's J-20 can't operate like that. Their pilots can't either. It's a cultural weakness, and it's unfixable. Now add autonomous F-35s into the mix, jets that don't need ground control, that think for themselves, that coordinate with drones in real time. China has no answer for that. Neither does Russia. Russia's trying to build next-generation fighters, but their economy is strained, their technology lags behind, and they don't have the AI capabilities the U.S. has spent decades perfecting. Meanwhile, the U.S. Air Force is planning to deploy over a thousand autonomous combat drones. They're called Collaborative Combat Aircraft, or CCAs, loyal wingmen. They'll fly alongside F-35s and the new F-47 sixth-generation fighter. These aren't cheap target drones. They're sophisticated machines with stealth coatings, advanced sensors, weapons bays. Each one costs a fraction of what an F-35 costs, but together they create what military strategists call affordable mass. You can lose a few drones and still win the fight. You can't afford to lose manned fighters. That's the game changer. Send the drones into the most dangerous areas. Let them take the hits. Let them suppress enemy air defenses. Clear a path for the manned fighters to strike with precision. And here's the kicker. The drones are expendable. The F-35 isn't. But when you combine them, you get a force that's nearly unstoppable. The math is simple. The advantage is enormous. Imagine you're a Chinese military planner. You've built air defenses, surface-to-air missiles, radar networks. You think you're ready. Then the battle starts, not with manned jets, but with waves of autonomous drones, dozens of them. They swarm your defenses. You shoot a few down, but more keep coming. Your missiles run out, your radar is jammed, and then, when your defenses are exhausted, the real strike arrives. F-35s, silent, invisible, launching precision weapons from beyond your range. You never saw them, you couldn't stop them. That's not a war, that's a massacre. And it's exactly what keeps Chinese and Russian generals awake at night. The US isn't just building better planes, they're building a system, a network, manned and unmanned platforms working together, sharing data in real time, through satellites, through secure links across air, sea, and land. The F-35 becomes the quarterback, the drones become the offensive line, and together they rewrite the playbook. Russia and China are trying to catch up, but they're years behind, maybe decades, and the gap is widening. Every single day, that technological advantage grows larger. Let's not forget what this means for our forces, the men and women who serve, who put their lives on the line every day. This technology keeps them safer. It reduces risk. Pilots can control drones from the safety of their cockpit or from the ground. Fewer lives lost, more missions accomplished. That's what innovation is for, to protect those who protect us. And the US military has always led the way in doing exactly that. They deserve our respect, our gratitude, and our support, because while others develop weapons to threaten, America develops weapons to defend, to deter, to ensure peace through strength. The autonomous F-35 isn't just a military asset, it's a message, a message that says, we're ready, we're ahead, and we're not backing down. September 17th, 2023 started as an accident. A pilot ejected, a jet flew on. But what happened next changed everything. The F-35 proved it didn't need a pilot to survive. And now the U.S. military is turning that into a weapon. A weapon China and Russia can't match, can't stop, and frankly, can't afford to face. The future of air combat is here, and it flies without fear. If you found this fascinating, hit that like button and subscribe for more stories on military innovation and global security. Thanks for watching.